Hello everybody, welcome back to our channel. I'm Belle, this is my mom behind the camera. Today we're going to be making a very simple pasta. Yeah, we're going to be using a breakfast sausage, which we are just cooking up now. We already have our pasta cooking in there because this won't take long. This meal only takes maybe 15 minutes, so if you're crunched for time, this is a really quick, simple, easy meal to make. We're also going to be adding some tomato or some basil and parsley fresh from our garden into the sauce. We have some celery and tomatoes here, the, the tomatoes from our garden. So we're going to be adding that to the pasta. We have some onion that I've already diced here, which is going to go into it. And instead of using a normal tomato uh, sauce, what we're going to use is we're going to use a can of diced tomatoes. Don't come for me in the comments down below for using something that's canned, but it makes for a really quick, simple, easy meal. If you have time to stew and dice your own tomatoes, please feel free to do so. But if you're just on a, a tight little budget and a tight schedule, this is also an easy way to go. So we're going to be back in a minute. We're just going to let that cook for a little bit and then we'll be back. Yep. So we're just stirring that sausage around right now so we can get it all cooked up. Okay, and into our uh, pot of pasta here that's cooking, we've also added a bit of canola oil to keep the noodles from sticking together, and some salt to keep it from uh, boiling up and getting all frothy and foamy at the top, so it doesn't boil over. Alright, so now our sausage is all cooked, we are going to add the onions to it. Next nope, one. just leave it for one second though. Let's cook up the onion a bit first. Okay, we found some of the nice yellow cherry-like tomatoes in our garden as well, so we decided to add those for a bit of pop of color into our pasta as well. Mm -hmm. So we're just going to cook these onions until they become more of a translucent color, and we'll be back with the next step. Alright, so... Our onions are looking a little translucent, and some of them are looking a little brown, but they're definitely giving off a nice aroma. So we're going to add in the next step now. We're going to add in the tomatoes and celery. Okay, and then we're going to add in the canned diced tomatoes. I'm just trying to mix it in. Okay, now we're going to add in the parsley and basil. That's done. Okay, and we're going to add just a little bit of a heat of spice. We're going to add some paprika. That should be good. And just a touch of chili powder. Next, we're just going to mix that all. We're just going to mix that all up and then we're going to let it simmer for a little bit. Mm -hmm. And we'll be back. Okay, so we have let this simmer 
And it, we're going to be adding some salt. No, we already added salt. Oh, we already added salt, sorry. Um, now we're going to do like a little taste test. I'll try to get mm, everything in there. No, just get the sauce, though. Just get the sauce? Okay. The sauce. Hot. That's good. That's actually really good. It's really hot, but it's really good. Heat hot, not spicy hot, right? Yeah, heat hot. Okay, so there you have it. A very quick, simple meal. With not very many ingredients, which works if you don't have a whole lot of ingredients in the house at the moment. Because, say, you got to go grocery shopping. If you want, you can also do like some garlic bread with this. We're just gonna put some have cheese on there if you right. want. So we're just gonna have the pasta itself. Mm -hmm. Let me turn this off. All right. Okay, so if you like our channel and you want to subscribe, feel free to hit the subscribe button. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you want, you can leave us a comment down below. And other than that, we're going to go have our supper now. So there we have it. It's Mommy Dotto Duro, and we will see you another time. Bye! Bye.